It is a pleasure to join Your Excellency and distinguished guests on this auspicious occasion commemorating the 75th anniversary of the National Foundation Day of the People's Republic of China. On behalf of the government and the people of the Republic of Kenya, I extend my warm congratulations to the government and the people of the People's Republic of China for this milestone. We also join in celebrating and commending the people of the People's Republic of China and heroes who bravely sacrificed for political and socioeconomic independence and advancements of the people and country. Indeed, we can confirm, we can all confirm that in the past 75 years, the government of China has made tremendous political and socioeconomic development that is unmatched in the world, which includes lifting the Chinese people from poverty to high quality living standards. China is the world's second largest economy, the largest manufacturer, the largest trader in goods, the second largest consumer of commodities, and the largest holder of foreign exchange reserves. Therefore, China is standing tall in global political and economic affairs and is a key stabilizer in an unstable global economy. Ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, China is committed to pursuing peaceful development, carrying out friendly cooperation with all countries on the basis of the five principles of peaceful coexistence and build and building a community with a shared future for mankind. Developing solidarity and cooperation with African countries is an important cornerstone of China's foreign policy. The outcome of the just concluded FOCAC Beijing summit will benefit all African countries that have diplomatic relations with China and effectively lead the China-Africa cooperation to new heights. The outcomes are of far-reaching significance for guiding the development of China-Africa relations and achieving modernization for both sides. China highly appreciates Kenya's significant contribution to the FOCAC Beijing Summit and stands ready to work with Kenya to implement the outcomes of the summit, continuously push forward the comprehensive strategic cooperative partnership between the two countries and make greater contributions to the building of an all-weather China-Africa community with a shared future for the new era. China and Kenya share a profound tradition of friendship. Our fruitful and wide-ranging practical cooperation stands out in China-Africa cooperation. Following the strategic guidance of the important common understandings between President Xi and President Rudolf, China is committed to working with Kenya to deepen the China-Kenya comprehensive strategic cooperative partnership by pursuing the goal of becoming three types of partners. We should be sincere partners of mutual trust, firmly support each other in safeguarding national sovereignty and independently exploring development paths suited to their national conditions. We should be cooperative partners of mutual benefit and win-win results, closely synergize the high-quality better road cooperation with Kenya Vision 2030 and its bottom-up economic transformation agenda build an East African connectivity hub and industrial belt, and strengthen cooperation in such areas as digital economy, new energy, economic and trade, poverty reduction, and agriculture development. We should be strategic partners in upholding fairness and justice, enhance communication and coordination on international and regional issues, work together to safeguard the common interests of the Global South 
and promote regional peace and stability. Kenya greatly values the strategic partnership with China, which is people-centered, mutually beneficial, and permanent. We are happy with the joint measures by both governments to enhance the Kenya-China strategic partnership through implementation of the joint vision for advancing modernization and building an even closer Kenya-China community with a shared future. This concrete joint policy is now part of Kenya's foreign policy and will continue to shape our bilateral engagements for enhancing our strategic partnership for the next 60 years. It is now my pleasure to invite you all to join me in a toast to the people of China, good health and long life of the leadership of Kenya and China, friendship of the two peoples, and to the prosperity of our two countries. May you hold your glasses. <laughs> Okay, to President Xi and the People's Republic of China on the 75th anniversary of their nationhood. Cheers. Thank you. China has further demonstrated how sustained good governance discipline and commitment to implement national development priorities, which is people-centered and long-term, and inclusive, sustainable modernization, which is unique to a particular country, and which reflects peculiar cultural and national needs and sensitivities. Distinguished guests, at the global level, it is also important to acknowledge China's indomitable best practices which contributes towards peace and stability and enhance South-South cooperation, including the five principles of mutual respect for sovereignty and territorial integrity, mutual non-aggression, non-interference in each other's internal affairs, equality, and mutual benefit and peaceful coexistence. China continues to be the North Star and a firm voice for many developing countries in an international system that is unfair, unjust, and insensitive to the peculiar needs of developing countries. Father, His Excellency President Xi Jinping's vision on countries pulling together for the good of humanity as espoused in the four initiatives, the Belt and Road Initiative, the Global Development Initiative, the Global Security Initiative, and the Global Civilization Initiative as well as the Forum for China-Africa Cooperation, FOCAC, are all attributes of efficient connectivity between and amongst continents and regions. These initiatives have spurred development and resulted to economic transformation of countries through implementation of projects, including in Kenya. The initiatives and FOCAC combined are catalysts towards impactful, affordable, and sustainable socioeconomic development, pulling together to build a community with a shared future for humanity. Ladies and gentlemen, China is Kenya's leading bilateral development partner. It has contributed to Kenya's long-term socioeconomic transformation in visible, tangible, and significant manner, especially in the last two decades under the Belt and Road Initiative. Other key sectors of the economy, such as ICT, renewable energy, education, and joint research, retail, hotel, and housing, have also benefited from the support of the government of China, as well as the participation of the Chinese private sector. In this context, the Kenya government will take deliberate steps to facilitate Chinese private sector investment in other sectors of the economy beyond the belt and road initiative projects. This is a deliberate move aimed at enhancing Kenya-China strategic partnerships and most crucially, ensure that every aspect of bilateral cooperation will bring our peoples together through a people-to-people -people contact and collaboration. 
Presently, Kenya is investing significant resources in infrastructure development so as to unlock existing yet unexploited opportunities to create jobs and alleviate poverty, especially in rural areas. Kenya acknowledges and appreciates the support of the government of China, without which Kenya would not be one of the key Belt and Road Initiative partners. Further, Kenya appreciates the government of China for encouraging the Chinese private sector to invest in Kenya in the Belt and Road Initiative projects as well as other sectors. Towards this end, the government is committed to the Kenya-China joint vision and advancing modernization, taking into account the 2024 FOCAC summit outcomes, while at the same time promoting the four initiatives at national, regional, continental, and global levels. Towards this end, the government is committed to the Kenya-China joint vision and advancing modernization, taking into account the 2024 FOCAC summit. At the multilateral level, Kenya enjoys historical collaboration with China on matters South-South cooperation. China is a strong voice for Kenya and other developing countries, a partnership that is focused on championing the reform of the international financial architecture to be a fair, just, and rule-based system. This will facilitate access to affordable financing for sustainable socioeconomic development in the long run. 